Every guy's had a girlfriend like this. You shouldn't have done that! Uh. It fucking hurts! Oh. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to Beards, Bourbon, and Games. I'm your host Mike today. Jim is not with me, but thankfully I have my buddy Corey. Corey has played every Resident Evil game with me. Except for seven, we figured out the other day. That's right. So this is kind of like the uh, like a reunion when a band gets back together. Except there's only two players in the band, and they're <laughs> a lot fatter and have bigger beards. <laughs> yeah, with Resident Evil Eight coming out, which is a continuation of Ethan's story, which is the main character of Seven, um, yeah, I thought it'd be a good idea to go back and play that, so we'll see how it goes here. Um, hopefully we don't get too scared and run off like, you know, scared little children. <laughs> I need an adult! <laughs> I am an adult! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, man, let's see how it goes here. Okay, so... New game? We're gonna do normal difficulty because, you know, we're, we're adults and can do adult things, like... Play video games. We're manly, man. We don't do none of that scrap stuff up in here. I just wanted to send a quick hello, and I love you. Oh, good news! I'm gonna be coming home soon. Yay! Her eyes just scream psychopath. Right. To be done with this babysitting job and come home to my loving husband. I do have to say, the first uh, RE engine. The people looked a little scary. I gotta get back to work. I love you, Ethan. I miss you so much. I'm sending tons. It is amazing how well optimized this engine is, though. I mean, it can, this game can run on a potato almost. Right? <laughs> uh oh. Ethan. Oh? You were right. I did lie to you. I shouldn't have. I told you to get the pink grape. Paul, I told you. If, if you get this, stay away. But what if I don't want to? You're supposed to be my love. <laughs> so the reality of this situation is. If this was the real world and he got that message, it would get halfway through it and start buffering and then give an error and drop out the message. So it would say, if you get this, then it. Basically. <laughs> you just disappeared the other night. Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. It's Mia. She's not dead. She's alive. She, she's back. They found her? Uh-oh. How? What happened? I don't know. Say anything. You ghosted you, brother. I don't know how. Exactly. she's back. She's back somehow. And maybe it's a prank. She wants me to come and get her. Where is she? Dolby. Dolby, Louisiana. It's a trap! <laughs> I know, I know, but what if it is her? I have Three to years. find out what happened. That's how long it's been. That's one thing, like, when they originally, like, some of the stuff I was reading when they made Seven, they wanted you to kind of feel like you were Ethan, which is pretty cool. Not watch the road. So, a fun fact for those watching at home, the inside of this car is very similar to the same model that Jill used to run over Nemesis in 3. <laughs> this is the place. So, if I, if I was Ethan, I'd get all the way to this point, I would look in these woods, I would take one look, look at the house, and just say, you know what? I got tender. I'm just going to go back home. <laughs> There's more. There's more fish out there. Man. They're, uh... Find Mia, okay? I feel like that was already established. But, you know... God, they need to fire their gardener. Did a horrible job. Oh, look. Giant mansion. This can only end in good things. At least they got the objective wrong point. Most <laughs> games would be open world. You would do everything else and go, 
Wait, why did I come down to Louisiana for? <laughs> hmm. Gate's locked. Might as well try to break in. Ah, nothing like breaking in any. So, I realized I pushed shift and I realized I was running, and I was like, oh, the game's like, you can run by pushing shift. Oh, this is from the demo. Uh, uh. Join us? Yeah, that doesn't sound bad at all. Sewer Gators, episode 17. Project Bros. Rule. Sneaking into Louisiana Ghost House. How's that in for you? I wonder if that's like a nod to Resident Evil 2's Gator Boss. <laughs> Maybe, actually. I never thought about that. Hmm. I don't know about you, but <sighs> flies. There's a wall. <laughs> Is that you, Papa? Creepy ball dude walking through the woods. That Let's fall on. Vanished. Uh. That's the thing in these games. These guys are a lot more adventurous than I am. I'm just kind of like, nope, 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 nope. <sighs> Yeah, I would have turned around the second I parked, but that's just me. <laughs> but you know what? She's dead. Time to go home. <laughs> oh, art. Very nice. I like the expression of the cow. <laughs> Do a... That's lovely. Hmm. Yeah. It, it would definitely be time to leave. <laughs> I love my wife dearly, but... Um... Mm. Maybe not. <laughs> this game looks really good, though. The RE engine was a really good thing they did. Yeah, it's amazing how flexible it appears to be. They seem to... You at first, when they said that they were going to remake 2 in the RE engine, I was a little bit skeptical because this is obviously a first-person engine, or so it seemed, right. until they proved me wrong, which is not hard to do, but hey. <laughs> oh, i got to be careful. This thing is, like, super sensitive. Can I not clean this off? We're just going to say that's dirt. On yes. That last... <laughs> totally dirt. Oh, there's some cleaning solution. Uh, yes, hello. I'm the FHA inspector. Come to appraise your home. <laughs> oh, he just happened to have a light on him. Good man. <laughs> I think we can clean this up a whole lot. Maybe get, get a tub of OxyClean. We'll have this whole place going in no time. <laughs> hmm. Huh, apparently I don't have the strength to uh, rip chains off. Man, I am hungry. <laughs> Yummy. Oh, fuck! Fuck! Protein. <laughs> I got a guy who can fix that for you. <laughs> yes, let's turn off the water because they're apparently worried about their water bill, obviously. Don't they know anything? That's how you get zombie virus, eating crows. <laughs> uh, he was just trying to dry the crow off. They gave him a bath. <laughs> Do we have any ham in here? There's spaghetti. Scaly moss. Uh, straight. I have no reflection. I'm a vampire. 
that's the real twist of the story. You thought it was zombies. <laughs> Okay. Oh, there's Mia, I think. Hmm. That puzzle looks familiar. Alright. I didn't want to play anyway. Ah. I promise I'll get that down eventually. Okay, so lots of cool things we can do here when we somehow figure it out. Door's locked. Guess we're going up. It's locked. <laughs> Shut up, high off mill. Hmm, <laughs> I don't think that's safe. Oh, it's fine. You know, the. Give, give the kid a fork, let the babies crawl around the floor. I mean, this whole house screams family-friendly. I mean, and what comes with your home is a wild landscape around and, and oh, tetanus. Because, you know, everybody that. <laughs> Yay, tetanus! Oh, this is how we save. Other than booting this up to like check the uh, make sure everything works, I've never actually played this game. Now that I think about it, I've watched it and loved it. It's... Oh, video. Best video ever. <laughs> oh, there we go. Ah, <laughs> uh, memories of my childhood coming back. Where did you find this guy? Give me a break, Pete. Hey, I only work with professionals. Speaking of which, make sure the sound is right this time. I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. That was two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. This new guy? I'm not feeling it. Again? Just don't be surprised if we have to make a change. Uh oh. New plan. We do a walk through the inside oh, first. Not working with you too. Then we shoot the intro, <laughs> just like we always do. Just try to say the show's name this time, okay? No problem. Tonight on Sewer Gators, another worthless fucking shithole. Happy? Ecstatic. Wow, I don't know about you, but they seem like good friends. Yes, I can feel the love just spewing from his eyeballs. <laughs> Are we rolling? Right, let's always. Go. <clears throat> ABR boy, always be recording. Get out of the way. I mean, can you just go ahead and just do it. Uh, kill the team stick. There we go. There we go. Adam boy. <laughs> After you. Everybody, hope that guy dies so, first. Everybody's like, why are we in thank you. Time? Do you ever prep? What's the prep? Shitty house, spooky sounds. Ooh, is it haunted? Yes. In Maybe. Fact. Fuck me. I was an anchor, you know? We can sub, Pete. Yeah, you'll be saying that here in a few moments, maybe. No. <laughs> What's the story, Andre? Could have been a Abandoned contender. farmhouse, missing family, foul play suspected. The usual. How long did you say this place has been abandoned? Forever. Three years. <coughs> Clancy! Get a shot of this. Let's make a great cutaway. So, uh, Hillbilly Joe and his family. And my question is to actually put that back on. Bakers. Oh, I Jack did. And Marguerite Baker. Jack Baker. And they were quiet, not backward. A lot of bad rumors about their son, Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. Ah, shit. I know I should have worn my good shoes. No, that's what you get. Oh, shit. Glad I had my shot. Ugh. Although anyone else deserves that the crow was not in the right way. Yes. Andre, what do you think? Andre? Andre. <laughs> that guy looks high. Andre! <laughs> He's dead, Jim. See where Andre went? 
Where is he? Unfucking believable. This is the last time I work with that guy. I mean, producers, they come and go, but a, a good cameraman like you, Clancy, you stick with me. Oh, there's a blinking red light up here. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to go this way. <laughs> Resident Evil 7 game design is like, okay, we're too, we're too open-ended. We got to guide the player. Oh, I know. Let's put a blinking light at the top of the stairs. <laughs> all, our, all our games are ADHD anyways. They'll, they'll follow it. <laughs> I, I noticed that in Lake Roth, but I was like, blinking red light. Must go to it. But it wouldn't let me click it. Uh-oh. What the fuck was that? Uh-oh. Did you hear that? No, I didn't. Go check it out. I'm betting possums. It's always possums. Andre? Where the fuck is he? Not here. And if he's smart, he's back home. Right? Andre, where are you, man? What the hell? Oh. You gotta be fucking kidding me. All right, new deal. We, we find Andre and we go. I mean, fuck this show. Right? Okay, here's the plan. You go first. <laughs> if I see a spray of red mist, <laughs> I'll just go home. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that guy's wallet's weighing his pants down. <laughs> oh, that looks safe. First, oh, there he is. Need a nice hero shot of me coming down the ladder. So, uh, you first. Sure. Do I have a GoPro on? <laughs> what do you Next see? question, man. Are you dead it? yet? an audio from the Kool-Aid man as he was approaching. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Jesus! You know, Macho Man Randy Savage. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, so that gave me a hint. Did I just pick that up? I didn't really pick it up. That's weird. Uh... Don't worry. We'll get 75% through the game and it'll say, you need a photo to go through this door. It'll be that photo, I guarantee it. That always happens to us. Hey, you know, I just saw those guys get murdered. I should go the same direct, exact way they went. Oh, yeah. Meanwhile, you hear an echo in the hall. Ooh, the macho man is coming for you. <laughs> oh. Hold on. Or not. Wow. Oh, and did we mention on the home listing, uh, slot termite damage, but don't worry, it's it's fixable. <laughs> so a fun fact that I learned while watching a speedrun at uh, a speedrunner conference of Resident Evil 7, uh, they, they told us some interesting fun facts about Louisiana. Homes in Louisiana cannot have basements because they're at sea level, and the basements will be underwater. <sighs> Makes sense. I didn't think about that though. Why is there a basement here? Yeah, I probably wouldn't want to, you know, stick my head under that water or drink any of that water. You know, looks, looks like it's got some kind of amoebas in it, probably. Hmm. <laughs> looks like it tastes good. Uh. Okay, who farted in the water? <laughs> My bad. Ah! Oh, God! 
Yep, that got me. Wasn't, wasn't expecting it. It got me. And just like that, that this is how Ethan got dysentery, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> hmm. Cage. I love cages. This seems like a very nice family. Yeah, complete with body hooks, blood-stained walls. I mean, it's family fun for everyone. Uh, been dead, turn, 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 dead, dead, dead. Uh, yeah, that that that's great. Yes, cutters of the bolts. This is going to go well. Totally well, great. Here is he walks up to her and she says, Ethan, you came for me. And he replies with, I just wanted to let you know I've moved on. I'm going back home. It's me. It's me. <laughs> Ethan? Are you all right? You shouldn't be here. What do you mean? You contacted me. No. Okay, no, we're going to be able to do that. That's what all the girls say when that happens. <laughs> Did anyone see you? Did he see you? Hey, who else is here? What the hell's going on? Daddy's coming. We need to go. Daddy? We need to go now! Daddy's coming. Wait, isn't that me? <laughs> <laughs> Where are you taking me? Someplace safe. Are you going to tell me what's going on? Nope. Baby, you've been gone for three years. Three years? We could tell you what's going on, but it's Has important it really that we allow you to develop as a character, so we're going to keep you in the dark for a little bit longer. <laughs> Plot device. I see nothing. What is this place? what they do to you? Not You're on point. Keep going. <laughs> get on first. I think it's this way. You think or you know? Well, this all looks great. So this is where the magic happens. Thank you. <laughs> this looks like my basement. We have to talk. That I didn't know we was in uh, whatever. Greg's name. I didn't. Oh, Shade okay, Greg. Fine. Just tell me what's going on. I'm telling you. I'm not. A, I'm not a desperate know. middle-aged housewife. I've never read it. We have oh, to you're talking about Fifty Shit. Uh, I don't know the name. <laughs> <laughs> Just for reference, everybody. Mike here read it purely for research. No other reason. Research. Family used to bring me food through here. I remember. Hey, Mike, I'm looking at this book, only a few select pages are worn, like heavily ruined. Like the beginning of the book and the end of the book hardly touch, but the middle sections that seem to be all the juicy parts are faded. <laughs> Why is that? <laughs> you know, something I've learned about playing these Resident Evil games, too, is that like me as a fat guy would die because I couldn't fit through there. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. It's, it's, it's the chrome fact that when a zombie outbreak occurs or whatever happens, the fatties are typically the first to go. <laughs> Can we... This is it. Is it? Are you sure? Okay. As long as she's sure. I remember this She is 97.01%. I'm sure of it. <laughs> yes, everybody knows, uh, Corey, that you only read the good pages. <laughs> We're going to be a family, now that you're here. Uh... There's another door here, I'm sure of it. Man, this girl moves fast. Disappears for three years, now she wants to tie the knot. Alright, E001. Oh. Oh. Uh... Okay. Granny! Oh crap, that's not creepy at all. No, leave me alone. 
Mia. Uh, I'm just gonna come back here. It's like you know what? No, I'm good. I'm gonna find another way out. I'll just uh, you know, yeah. See you later. Can I just go the way I came? Stairs, yay! Nope, nope, nope. That's a bunch of nope. Yep, time to hop into the nope car, go down the nope highway, stop by Nopeville, hang out with the Nopeville mayor. <laughs> Paper. Phone. Hello, Ghostbusters. Ah, yes. So, not to break the immersion, but if this house was truly abandoned for three years, why is the electricity still on? <laughs> they have their own generator or thingy. It runs on evil energy. Ah, got it. Thank you for clarifying that. I can hey, sleep easy tonight. I'm here for you. Okay, I just like how it's giving me a bunch of med kits. Uh, and that's it. Don't answer the door, it's back, salesman. <laughs> You'll clean one half of your carpet and leave the other half looking like crap. Where's that coming from? Uh, well, look how it is. Am I missing a door? Yes, we go to back down to the date and uh, I can talk. Yes, we go back down into the basement then. Yep. What the? Uh. Oh, wow. there, 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 there's something wrong with your face. Okay. Oh, okay. Ocelot! Ocelot! My safe word is Ocelot! So, what we've seen of her before was her without the hat, hat filter. Or her with the snap oh. filter, and this her without it. Now, oh. that was amazing. God. Yeah. Wait. Wait! Ow! Oh, right. healing uh, medicine or whatever it is. Chop off a limb, just pour it on and it'll be alright. Oh, help me. I need to get out of here. Oh, crap. I done screwed up. Oh, better quit. This is the bust. So this part I hear, everybody I'm pretty sure everybody has an ex-girlfriend who has acted like this in one way or another. Or maybe it's just Right? Oh, good. Axe. And most of them end up living in West Virginia afterwards for some reason. <laughs> I don't know why. Uh, 
Punch her in the face! Yeah! Oh, look, they turned they turned the Snapchat filter back on. <laughs> uh, yeah, let me use that healing kit that I accidentally used before. We're probably gonna die here. Yes, this is the real estate salesman. How are you liking that new home? <laughs> And what the fuck is going on? My name's Zoe. There should be a way out through the attic. Attic? Go there. Now. Go there, Shea. Over there. Oh man. Great. That's not ominous at all. <laughs> Need more health. Oh. You two handed. Meanwhile, Ethan's like, boy, I'm glad I got rid of her. Right? <laughs> Everything's going to be A okay now. Yep, Nothing at all bad could happen. She's totally dead. This, this is. This is good. This is good. This is how it should be. Oh. Oh. I bet I know what. Do I still have those? Okay, I do have them. <laughs> Where did it start raining? Huh? Have a uh, a health kit, please. Oh no! It was just a figment of your imagination. I hope so. Oh. He finally got rid of her creepy ex. Everything's gonna be fine. Nothing bad's gonna happen. Good thoughts, good thoughts. Good things. And for some reason, somebody thought it was a good idea. You know what? I'm going to take this one fuse out of the fuse box. I'm going to put it in this random cabinet in this hallway. And I'm going to, oh, and I'm going to chain the doors to it. You know, <laughs> reasons. <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? It's okay. It's okay. It's me. No, it's not. This is, this is another one of those ex-girlfriend moments. Oh, man. Every guy's had a girlfriend like this. You shouldn't have done that! Uh. It fucking hurts! Oh! 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 Oh, uh. Nope, nope, nope. Put that away. Put that away. You don't need to have that. Power tools are bad. There goes his hand. Too, but ow okay this is green now which means go right Ugh. 
like I'm holding the stump. I'm probably not bleeding out now. Always said he was just better off just downloading Tinder and leaving. <laughs> yes. Okay. Fine. Oh, look, a healing item. Ah. Oh, my hand feels so much better. Okay, nothing in boxes. Wow, I just got 20 hanging bullets. You see that? God, it gave me so many bullets. So, boss fight! Here we go! Because I thought, you know, maybe he might have lived. <laughs> oh, that sucked. She is dangerous and goes berserk. Do whatever it takes to stop her. Okay, thank you. We unloaded a whole clip in her. <laughs> Alright, so we're back here. Serpentine. Quick, Mike, Serpentine. <laughs> this is not a good what idea. What are you hiding? Then? What don't you want me to know? <laughs> Yeah, we, Ethan thinks this is a good time to talk to you about your own relationship. I think we should see other people! Help! Help, police! Be safe, put one more in the head, you know. <laughs> I love you, pal. Remember when I said it wasn't you, it was me? I was lying, it was all you. <laughs> it's, it's always been you. All right, uh, welcome to the oh. oh, God, thanks, Daddy. <laughs> Nothing like being drunk to the mud in the 
rain. <laughs> on a cool Louisiana evening. Heck, I don't even know what I'm saying. <laughs> it's okay, we're unconscious. Come on. Don't you Oh, that makes me feel you. a lot better. You have Good. work to do. Oh, he just what are they? So that makes me wonder, can you really staple your hand to your arm and save it? Like, Obviously, this is a game, but uh, I always found that kind of interesting how they handled that mechanic. That's crazy. I mean, personally, I would have gone for a chainsaw option. Right? What the hell? Rise and shine, sleepyhead. It's time for supper. Mama? Who are all you people? I think I'm good. I like my steak to be colored, you know... Normal steak color, not it's green. Ow! Nothing wrong with this family. Hit boy's got to eat. He got to have his supper. Come here, boy. Let's do this. Oh. Shit, oh shit, oh shit, he's not eating the jack! He's not eating it! Get the hell up, Marguerite! Oh, they for him! Get the hell out of here! You're a son of a bitch! Oh, I can't believe it, you son of a bitch! He's not eating it! He's not eating it! This was supposed to be a very special feast. Come on, boy. No, I got these scars. <laughs> God damn it. I bet it's that cop again. God damn pigs. Ooh. I'm coming back for you. Don't. You're good. Just just stay there. Okay, bye daddy. Thank you for the lesson. All right. Um, well, I think that's a good spot to stop for this first episode. Thanks for coming by. We'll see you next time. See you.